Hi, this is Krishna Merchant and thank you for joining us for the Market Roundup. The Indian markets ended lower today after Reserve Bank of India surprised the markets by raising the repo rate by 25 basis points. The rate-sensitive shares were the top losers today. The Sensex was down around 1.9% to end at 20,264. A tad about the 6,000 mark at 6,012. For the week, the markets were up though around 3%. The rupee uh, today fell in trade, but for the week it has recovered and it ended above the 62 mark. Uh, yesterday, uh, uh, the day before yesterday, Ben Bernanke said that uh, he will keep uh, the bond buying program on hold now, which uh, led to a rally in uh, most of the emerging markets, including India. Markets were up 3.5%. Today, they gave up uh, most of the gains that they made yesterday. The top losers were the banking shares. This is after Reserve Bank of India increased the repo rate by 25 basis points to 7.5%. However, they lowered the marginal standing facility by 75 basis points uh, from a high of 10.2%. Well, this will bring down the short-term rates and also reduce the cost of funds according to analysts. But uh, banking shares uh, both the brand and they were the top losers today. Remember, they have also run up in the la past week. ICICI Bank was uh, one of the top losers. It was down 5%. HDFC Bank and State Bank of India fell 3.5% each. From the smaller banks, Indian Bank, Syndicate Bank and Yes Bank, they were all down 8%. From the capital goods space, Larson and Tubro plunged 5%. Even realty shares uh, uh, saw um, have heavy selling today. DLF was down 11% and it, uh, HDIL fell around. 8%. From the broader markets, mid caps and small cap indices were marginally down. Top gainers uh, were on the Sensex uh, were Sun Pharma up 1.5%, Wipro advanced 0.8%, and Gale was up 3.5%. Uh, since the monetary policy is over, um, uh, now the focus will shift to the earnings season and also the fiscal cliff in the US. That is all for today. Do stay tuned to livemint.com for more updates.